like, camera, action. Oh wait, we're already starting? Oh well. Hello everybody, this is me, JP, and today we're doing another episode of Great Math, and this is number 89. Let's get started. Another geometry problem, right here, let's, let's see. Okay. Shown at the right is a circular cylinder. That is not right. When I meant by right, I meant like the... As this is an actual cylinder. I know, horribly drawn. This, it's not a right angle at the base. At the connection of the two, um... At the two... It, of the two centers of the... Um, of the two circles inside the cylinder. Okay. The bases have centers A and B as shown. See, there's A, that's B. And point C is on the circumference of the base. Given that AB is equal to 8, BC is equal to 4, and angle ACB is equal to 90 down here, find the height of the cylinder and the volume. Okay, so the height of the cylinder, note that it's the actual height. Just like a triangle, if you have, if it's like this, which is going to be a little weird, the height is this, okay? The height is this, not not this, it's not this, but it's this, okay? Just like that, the height is AC. So we just have to do some Pythagorean theorem. So if we bring that here, it's another just right triangle. But this is four and this is eight, okay? So it is, actually I already know the answer. From another one of our videos, we showed that in a right triangle, eight, eight, and eight, we have that, that's four and four, and then no matter what, half of it, this height is always one half of um, uh, the square root of three times one half of the side length. So it will be four square root of three. We already know that. So the height of it is four and square root of three. Okay, that's our answer. Okay, now let's go to B. What's the volume? Okay, so it's the height times the circ times the um, area of the circle right here. So how do we know that? Well, actually, BC is the radius because that's part of the circumference all the way to the center. See, that's the radius right there. So BC, which is 4. So let me just draw that. 4, okay, so that's 4 squared times pi and then times the height times 4 times the square root of 3. So that is 16 pi times 4 times the square root of 3. Then that's 64 times the square root of 3 pi. So that's our answer. 64 times the square root of 3 pi. That is the volume right there, which goes for this one. See, not too hard. Just saying, if you guys find any slanted ones, this will be probably easy. Remember, this is the main thing. The height is not how where from A to B is, but where the actual height, the legitimate height is. Like, how tall is it, like, to the very maximum it could be. Okay. And this is the end of our episode, sadly. And um, I hope you guys uh, enjoyed this video. And please do subscribe. Please give a big thumb. Bleh. Big fat thumbs up and um, subscribe. Thank you and see you later.